It's Tori, your 2015 Monster Energy Pit Reporter, and today we are in Jacksonville, Florida. And aside from showing you all the typical bands and sponsors and nonprofits and all that cool stuff, I wanted to take this time to do a crew appreciation video because there are a lot of people behind the scenes that make Warp Tour happen that you don't always get to see. And I want to show you what they do and how they make Warp Tour amazing. So let's go check it out. So first up, it is 8 a.m. It is pretty early in the morning, and Setup crew gets up really early to make sure all the stages and tents and everything that you see at Warp Tour gets put together in time for doors at 11 a.m. So here is what all of Setup looks like. Hey, it's Kevin Lyman, uh, founder of the tour and producer of the tour. But really my job is to be on site, to kind of react to things. This summer, a lot of it has been to do to weather. We've had a lot of bad weather, as for some of you who have been out at the shows. And it's going to ultimately be my call to keep a show going, to stop it, to readjust schedules, to write the schedule each morning. But I am here to support everyone else. Hello, my name's Lisa Brownlee. I'm in the tour manager for the Vans Warp Tour. This is my 20th year, probably older, longer than most of you have been alive. Uh, I am the tour manager, which means basically I babysit all these people. But currently, during this Florida run, I am the Warp Tour weather girl. Lisa Lightning, they call me. So, my, every day, 12 hours a day, I'm watching the weather so you can be safe at the Vans Warp Tour. Hi guys, I'm Selena with Talai Catering. We're here getting ready for lunch. We're going to serve about 800 people in two hours. We try to get everything on the menu, nice and perfect for all the vegans, vegetarians, and gluten-free people. And then we also have volunteers come out that come and attend the show. And we have a little thing that we call, How's My Line? Woo! Woo! Wait, you know what time it is? Dance, dance break, break, dance break, dance break, dance break, dance break, dance break. Dance break. Yeah, what's up? Ta -da! Ta -da! <laughs> hey guys, my name's Sierra Lyman. I run all of our nonprofits out here on the Vans Warp Tour. Along with nonprofits, we do special things like Make a Wish Days, Living the Dream, and those type of stuff. Come check by our tent, the United United Eco Tent, for some great local volunteering opportunities. Hey guys, I'm Danielle Martel. I'm your Vans Warp Tour press manager. Basically, what I do is I'm like a matchmaker for the vans and the press outlets. Each day, the vans come check in with me every morning. Uh, we set a time for interviews later on, and then we spend all day coordinating interviews. We hope to see you out here this summer. Thanks. Hi, I am Kate Truscott, and I am one of the sponsorship managers on the Vans Warp Tour. Uh, this is the production office today. It's outside of a trailer, uh, but this is sort of command central for all things Warp Tour. It's where everyone comes to get the information they need and where we kind of try to keep things together to take care of everyone. Um, my department is in charge of all of sponsors and all of our vendor relationships and those kinds of things. Uh, we also take care of all the bands here. Um, yeah, this is sort of the epicenter of, of uh, the tour. Hey guys, it's Chuck from Official Warped Merchandise. I'm the head of all merch for the summer. I place all these tents that you see out here. Yeah, try to keep it moving. Most of the main stage bands will have their merch on here. This is, this whole section right here is official Warp Tour merch. Here's Blackville Brides merch. Before it all goes into the tent and we sell it to you guys. Pierce the Veil, all Pierce the Veil merch. Uh, we came as Romans. More Pierce the Veil. So every day before you guys all get here and this entire world gets built, this where we're standing right now is all the bins and all the tents and all the tables that you see out there. Hi everybody, my name is Julie Grant and I'm the operations manager here at the Warp Tour. Essentially my job is doing a lot of the behind the scenes communication. I also do a lot of work with bands planning the tour. A large part of my job is creating the daily schedule. As a lot of you know, on Warp Tour we make the schedule the morning of the show day. Bands don't know when they're playing until that morning and fans also don't know the set times. It's, it's all part of the plan. We do that because we want to give bands and fans a chance to see everyone and not just uh, come for the, for the higher level bands on the tour. We want the baby bands to also have a chance to have a good crowd and most importantly we want people to discover new music on the Warp Tour and this gives them a chance to do that. Hi, I'm Dustin Jenkins. I'm the tour manager for Memphis May Fire. This is my fifth Warp Tour and I'm very excited to be a part of it. Uh, as a tour manager, I am the captain of the ship. I have a great crew and I take care of everybody, including the band, crew, and anybody else I need to. 
Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Dakota Gartner and I work with the Entertainment Institute. Pretty much every day I wake up and I have to deal with a bunch of different things from working with my staff to push all of our equipment to working with the artists to make sure that they're scheduled at the right time to teach their classes. And um, then everything in between. If it rains, we deal with the rain. If it is really ridiculously hot, we deal with that. And we kind of all work together within the production crew in order to make each day happen in the best way possible so you guys can have an awesome time. So that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope all this footage gave you guys a better idea of what happens here behind the scenes at Warp Tour. And you got to see some of the incredible people who make Warp Tour the absolute best day ever for you guys. So there are more pit vlogs on the way coming soon. So I will see you in the pit.